hello guys you're welcome back to my channel my name is tessie good morning good afternoon and good evening to you all depending on where you are watching from and thank you so much for stopping by some nigerians have kicked against the uk's asylum visa option for members of the indigenous people of biafra ipob Recall that the UK Visas and Immigration, UKVI, released new guidelines on how to consider and grant asylum applications to members of Biafran secessionist groups. To its embassy staff, asylum is to be granted to persecuted members of IPOB and MASOP, the guideline said. But Nigerian government immediately condemned the decision by the UK, alleging it was sabotage on the fight against insecurity. Some Igbos and Nigerians reacting on social media rejected UK's offer, insisting that Biafrans need a referendum and not asylum. Some described the offer as a blow to President Buhari's administration. Here are some comments gathered by Daily Post from Twitter. I'm just going to read out some, uh, some of the comments for you guys and um, I'll share my little opinion and I'll let you all uh, share your thoughts with me on the comment section. This person here says, I support referendum and not asylum to IPOB and MASOP. All of us can't leave our land to a foreign land. Hmm, perfect comment. This person here says, UK and Nigerian government think they are smarter and plotting to use asylum to destroy Biafra agitation. Now they know Biafra. They know IPOB are more serious. Another person here says, they should understand that Biafrans love their land and can never fall for any enticement such as asylum which is the last game. Someone here says, all we need is referendum. Someone here, someone here says, Britain so love the Igbo people that they want to give asylum to IPOB, but not Biafra nation. Hypocrites of the highest order. Hmm. Someone here says, decision by the Britain government to give political asylum to IPOB and mass of members is a major diplomatic victory. For the, so for the separatist organization and a major blow to Buhari regime coming from the biggest foreign supporter and enabler of Nigerian state, a major vote phase. Okay. Another person here says, UK asylum to IPOB is like the devil giving you a gift with his right hand <laughs> and collecting it back with his left hand. We Biafrans are not destitute. We are not running away from our land of heritage. Neither are we scared of defending our territory. We need referendum, not asylum. Hmm. Another person here says, Ask the UK government offering asylum to IPOB if they are prepared to give asylum to over 15 million Biafrans persecuted and oppressed every day in Nigeria. Biafrans need freedom, not political asylum. We can't be refugee in another man's country. Why abandoning our own land? Hmm. Brilliant. We are not asylum seekers in our fatherland and x way. All we need is a referendum. Someone here says, UK is not our home. Biafra is our home. Give us freedom, not asylum. IPOB want to be free from a terrorist country called Nigeria, not asylum. Someone here says, same federal government that loves granting amnesty to terrorists is angry that the UK want to grant ordinary asylum to IPOB members. Hmm. Your hatred for Ndibu shall be your undoing. Hmm. Someone here says, federal government says UK decision to grant asylum to IPOB members is disrespectful. The president going for medical checkup in the UK isn't disrespectful to federal, to federal government. If federal government thinks only IPOB will jump on this offer with the way Nigeria is becoming unbearable for the masses, the joke is on federal government. Someone here says, UK, we need referendum, not asylum. And another person here says, anyone asking for a referendum under Buhari's government is building castle in the air. It can never happen. Hmm.
Someone here says, we are not going to be refugees in another man's country. We want to live as a free people, build a civilized society rather than living in a country where some uneducated people drive cows here and there like lunatics. Someone here says, an independent state of Biafra will ensure a worthy life to Biafrans. At UK government, thank you for the asylum granted to persecuted IPOB and MASOP members. What we want is referendum, not asylum. And uh, someone here says, someone here says, IPOB want referendum, not asylum at uk in nigeria at 10 downing street can't provide asylum to over 50 million ipob members secondly we be our friends we never run away from our land because of some migrated miscreant parading as leaders Mm -hmm. Someone here says, all we Biafrans are saying is, Britain, give us referendum. We want freedom and not your asylum grant. We want to take control of our destiny. This is why we want our Biafra restored back to us. And someone here says, game over for Britain. We did not request for asylum. All we want as Biafrans are referendum. And that is what we will get. Someone here says, someone here says, we believe in Biafra and Biafra we want. The British government is trying to play the good one here, but their game will never work for them. We Biafrans don't need their asylum. Rather, we want our referendum. Asylum is not what we want. Hmm. Perfect. All right. I'm just going to take these two comments here and, um, we call it a day. Someone here says, your killer cannot be your protector. UK government, Biafra, Biafrans are not asking for asylum in your country. What we want is referendum. What we want is freedom. We want to be free from terrorists and terrorism in Nigeria, which you are fully aware of in Nigeria. IPOB agitation for restoration of Biafra through a referendum, which is the most civilized way to settle political issue. Note, like David and Goliath, we Biafrans didn't come this far and not to throw this stone. We don't want asylum. All we want is referendum. This comment here says, we want referendum, freedom for Biafrans, not a useless asylum. So get that into your ignorant brains. All right, uh, my people. And uh, that is it for you all. I have a lot of reaction from Twitter that if I want to read, maybe we may not live here today. So I'm just going to leave you all to share your thoughts with me on the comment section. Uh, it is good to see the people who really want something standing for what they want. You understand? Because a lot of people are like, I'm shocked to see all this reaction. That means these people, they know what they want and they stand by what they want. And with the way things are going, nothing. And I mean, absolutely nothing can change their mind from what they want. And according to them, all they want is referendum, not asylum from anywhere. So... I'm just going to leave you all to share your thoughts with me on the comment section. And with that, I will say thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate you. Uh, don't forget to share, like, and subscribe. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.